Hi, I'm Trinity with the Milan Library in Perryville, part of Central Arkansas Library System. Today, I have a family story time for you about fireflies. The first book I'll share is called Firefly Home by Jane Clark. The second book I'll read is called Ten Flashing Fireflies by Philemon Sturgis. And the last book I'll share is called The Very Lonely Firefly by Eric Carle. First, we'll always read our favorite book, If You're Happy and You Know It, by David A. Carter. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, wag your tail. If you're happy and you know it, wag your tail. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, wag your tail. If you're happy and you know it, pat your head. If you're happy and you know it, pat your head. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, pat your head. If you're happy and you know it, flap your wings. If you're happy and you know it, flap your wings. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, flap your wings. If you're happy and you know it, Wink your eye. If you're happy and you know it, wink your eye. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, wink your eye. If you're happy and you know it, touch your toes. If you're happy and you know it, touch your toes. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, touch your toes. Here's our favorite part. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! Okay, let's get started. Firefly Home by Jane Clark. Illustrated by Britta Teckentrop. There was no place like home, and this special place is home for fireflies. Fireflies have a bright light inside them that shimmers and shines, but wait, one little firefly is missing. Here she is, all by herself. Her name is Florence. Say hello, Florence. Poor Florence looks very sad. Do you think she is lost? Let's see if we can help her find her way home. Where shall we start? Oh, look, there's a bright light peeping through the trees. Could that be home? Let's turn the page and see. No, that's not home. It's just the big bright moon above the sparkling sea. What about those flashes of light over there? Could that be home? No, that's not home. It's just a lighthouse shining out to the boats bobbing on the water. Now Florence has spotted a long line of moving lights. Could that be home? No, that's not home. It's just a train whizzing down the track. But the train's lights are so pretty that Florence wants to follow them. Say, fly faster, Florence, and flap your hands to show her how to fly really fast. That was fast. And look, 
Where are we now? We're in the big city. There are bright lights everywhere. But is this home? No, this isn't where fireflies live. These lights are too bright. And where's Florence? She's lost again. Can you point to her? Yes, there she is. Let's quickly turn the page and help her fly away. That's better. The park is lovely and calm, but poor Florence still looks very sad. She really needs to find her way home. Perhaps maybe we need to make a wish. Let's wish on a shooting star. There are lots of shooting stars here. Close your eyes and wish very hard that Florence will find her way home soon. Wait, are they really shooting stars? No, they are fireflies. They will know the way home. Trace the bright firefly trails with your finger and say, fly, Florence, fly, to help her follow them all the way home. Your wish has come true. Florence is so happy to be home at last with all of her firefly friends. Whisper, night, night, Florence and blow her a good night kiss. Night, night, Florence. The end. 10 Flashing Fireflies by Philmon Sturgis. What do we see in the summer night? 10 flashing fireflies burning bright. Catch the one twinkling there like a star. One flashing firefly in our jar. What do we see in the summer night? Nine flashing fireflies burning bright. Capture another one. Now there are two flashing fireflies in our jar. What do we see in the summer night? Eight twinkling fireflies blinking bright. Let's catch another one. Now there are three twinkling fireflies in our jar. What do we see in the summer night? Seven bright fireflies. What a sight. Catch the one by the bush. Now there are four flickering fireflies in our jar. What do we see in the summer night? Six sparkling fireflies blinking bright. Catch the one flying high. Now there are five fiery fireflies in our jar. What do we see in the summer night? Five fiery fireflies flashing bright. Get the one way up there. Now there are six sparkling fireflies in our jar. What do we see in the summer night? Four flickering fireflies, flashing light. You've caught another one. Now there are seven bright fireflies in our jar. What do we see in the starry night? Three twinkling fireflies, glowing light. I've caught another one. Now there are eight twinkling fireflies in our jar. What do we see in this dark blue night? Two flashing fireflies, golden light. We've caught another one. And now there are nine flashing fireflies in our jar. 
What do we see in this dark, dark night? One flashing firefly's lonely light. I'm glad we caught it. For now, there are 10 flashing fireflies in our jar. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten fireflies. Let's go to bed by the jar's bright light. Pull up the covers and say good night. Watch them all carefully. Look, they are blinking so slowly in our jar. Open the jar for it's much more fun watching them fly away one by one. Out the window and flash goodbye. Fly away, fly away. Firefly. Ten. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Dash away, flash away. Now there are none. The end. The Very Lonely Firefly by Eric Carle. As the sun set, a little firefly was born. It stretched its wings and flew off into the darkening sky. It was a lonely firefly and it flashed its light searching for other fireflies. The firefly saw a light and flew toward it, but it was not another firefly. It was a light bulb lighting up the night. Hear that noise. The firefly saw a light and flew toward it but it was not another firefly. It was a candle flickering in the night. What's going on? The firefly saw a light and flew toward it, but it was not another firefly. It was a flashlight shining in the night. Quiet out there. The firefly saw a light and flew toward it, but it was not another firefly. It was a lantern glowing in the night. What is it? Hey, stop fighting. The firefly saw several lights and flew toward them, but they were not other fireflies. There was a dog. Bow wow. And a cat. Meow. Yes. An owl. Their eyes reflecting the lights. Woohoo. The firefly saw a light and flew toward it, but it was not another firefly. It was a car's headlights. Flooding the night. Look, wow, it's beautiful. The firefly saw many lights and flew toward them, but they were not other fireflies. They were fireworks sparkling and glittering and shimmering in the night. When all was quiet, the firefly through, flew through the night, flashing its light, looking and searching again. Then the very lonely firefly saw what it had been looking for. A group of fireflies flashing their lights. 
Now the firefly wasn't lonely anymore. The end. I hope you like those books. Let's sing a song before we go. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high. Like a diamond in the 